Life is good at our new campsite. I'm loving my fold-out waterproof mat. I should have bought this thing early in the summer. Man, makes you like a, like you got a little porch out here. It's psychological. Plus, it keeps you know from getting crap in the trailer. I uh, changed the inverted V legs, and it uh, I took it off the bungeed off the fence. And now I have the leg coming down here, bungeed to my water bottle. And that's the left leg. I have the ladder line coming down pretty much straight in the center. And I have the right leg coming down here to this. So we've got a V. And it's doing pretty good. You know, there's a lot of storms in the area, so I'm listening to uh, one net. Three of the bike here, uh, Grant. We're just about on you. Eight, six, P-O-R, P-B-A-T-G with the Buckeyes. It's an Ohio, Ohio net. They're called the Buckeye net. So those guys are coming all the way in out of Ohio. So it's doing pretty well on receive. Shaggy's up on... I tried to get him to lay on the mat, but he prefers to lay on the table. He is really out of it ever since that near drowning incident. Look, look at him. Shaggy. What's up, buddy? Watch up. He's out of it, man. You okay? He's just out of it. I think he's just tired. And, uh,. A bunch of ducks come up here. Oh, well, a bunch of ducks come up here looking for handouts. This is one of the Golden City water supplies right here. I'm starting to starting to look at other branches to throw that G5 RV into. I was thinking that one, but see, I can't throw it up over that because it's going to land on the other side of the fence. I mean, I could, I could hop the fence, but you don't want to get caught doing that. So see that that branch there was I could throw it this way and keep it landing on the inside of the fence. I was thinking I could probably do the same thing with this branch here that's up higher. It's kind of a pain to take it down, but I think I can do it. Boy, it'd be up another a couple of feet anyway. I'm just going to go through tonight like we always do. We can do a several night experiment. Let's see how it does tonight. I'm pretty sure it's going to do really well. And then tomorrow night we can throw it up over that one see see what the difference is. We got, uh, feels like some rain coming. It's nice and cloudy. There's the repeater antenna. What I want to do is go to a ham radio outlet one day and get a magnet mount for the front of the trailer, a two meter 440. Instead of using the one off the truck, put it right here. I don't know why that sign has to be in my sight. We're clear.